Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your Google contacts and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you download your Google contacts? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved, so be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you wanna download your Google contacts anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know it's important to keep track of all of your sales contacts, and maybe you're gonna be uploading them into a CRM. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Google account. First, you just need to go to google.com. You can do this on a desktop or a mobile browser. It'll work the same. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But here I am on the Google homepage on my Safari browser. And the first thing you wanna do if you want to download your Google contacts is you need to click on these nine little dots next to your profile icon here on the top right. Once you do that, you're going to see a drop down menu. And in order to download your Google contacts, you need to scroll until you see this button here called contacts. Okay, so once you click there, you will see a long list of all the contacts that you've uploaded into your Google contacts. So in order to download your Google contacts, what you need to do is click on this little upward arrow here towards the top. Okay, once you do that, you get to choose the file format. So you can do a CSV file, an Outlook CSV, or a V card. So they let you know this is if you're going to be exporting from here and then importing into your Apple device. Also, you can go ahead and download and export all of your Google contacts, or if you just want a certain portion of them, you can go ahead and click here, and then you can go ahead and export only the frequently contacted or you can go ahead and create labels, export lists, if you've separated all of your contacts into different labels. So for me, I'll go ahead and do frequently contacted and I'll do a Google CSV and then you just click on export down here on the bottom right in blue. Okay, next you'll get a pop-up asking if you'd like to download your Google contacts in that file format and if so, click on download. Okay, a few seconds later, the file has downloaded. You can see this one turned out to be 12 KB. So now you can go ahead and upload your Google contacts into your CRM, maybe into another device. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to download your Google contacts, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.